Hello and welcome in this particular video series. My goal is to help you understand how to use YouTube. I'm going to give you a quick overview in this particular video, but I'm also going to show you how to optimize your video so that you can get some traffic from the YouTube system. You can get some rankings on Google itself so that you can get more people viewing your video and more people interested in your product, your service, or the message that you are trying to convey. So first things first, what I wanna do in this particular video is just to give you a quick overview of YouTube here so that you understand how to use it to upload your videos. Now, YouTube has changed a bit, so I'm going to make sure that I point out a few things. To access your channel, you're going to have to go to YouTube. In order to be logged in, you do need to have a Google account. If you do not have a Google account, it's the same thing as having a Gmail account. So simply click on sign in and log in with your information. If you don't have an account, you can create an account for free. So as you can see, I am currently logged in. And what I need to do to access my channel is to simply click on my channel here. Now up at the top, if you would like to edit your channel, all you have to do is click on the about link right here. At this point in time, you're gonna see your channel, you're gonna see your picture up here, you got your channel art here, you've got your video manager, which allows you to edit and take a look at your analytics for your existing video. So if you click on this, you'll be able to access that. You'll also be able to view as public. So if you click on this link here, you can see what the public sees when they view your channel. Now down below here, you can see home, which shows your uploads. You can click on videos to see your videos. You can click on playlist to see your playlist, which in this case, you'll also be able to create your own playlists in this section. And if you're not familiar with what playlists are, they are lists of a bunch of videos. So you can create, for example, if you had a series of videos, one, two, three, four, five, you could create a playlist for that particular series. Or you can also create a playlist filled with other people's videos along with yours. Now, we're gonna talk about that later down the road. We got channels and of course about, and if you click about, this will allow you to edit your channel. So as you can see, it says channel description and links. This area here will allow you to edit your channel. So you can add your website, you can add a little more information about your channel. But before you do that, you need to do some research on your competitors and other videos that are out there. So if you click on channel description, you're going to see a box here and you can tell people a little bit about your channel. Now, keep in mind that most people don't really care about you per se. They care about you in the sense that you can help them. So to really impact people, you want to have a clear description here about how your channel can impact your viewers. And then of course, under links, this allows you to add your email for business inquiries. If you want to do that, you can add a overlay and also other social links as well. And this will allow you to link to your other social network. If you see here, I click on add and you can choose from other various social media sites. So essentially these are kind of like backlinks to these other sites. And up at the top right hand corner, you're gonna be able to see that you can also do other things like add channel art, you can describe your channel, you can add a section, and you can also add a channel trailer that's specifically for that particular channel. Now, if we go back over to the dashboard and we click on my channel and then click on video manager, you're gonna be able to see your video manager, which allows you to see your all of your videos. So currently I have about 56 videos in this particular account. And this enables you to edit each individual video. You can click here to see the actual video itself. 
You can see when it was published. You can see how many likes. You can see the statistics and other things like that. And YouTube is really good at giving you the exact statistics as far as different types of people who visit your videos, how long they view your video. So you can see perhaps how long do they actually view your video or do they stop viewing your video about midway because of a certain thing. So that gives you the ability to improve your video if you choose to do so. And then of course, under video manager, you can see live events, playlists, tags, and tags will show all the different tags that you're using in your videos. You can see your own search history that doesn't really impact anything and you can see your likes. And then we have other things like community channel, more details in analytics and things like that. So now that I've pretty much given you a quick overview, I could go further, but in terms of uploading your videos, these sections mainly impact that purpose. So with that said, let's move on to the next video and we're going to do some research on your competitors, how they're doing things, how they're ranking and things like that, because I don't really recommend that you jump right in and start editing your channel description yet. You want to see who you're up against, how they're doing, what they're doing so that you can get a better idea on how to compete with them. Now, if your goal is not necessarily to do that, that's fine. But if you really want to get some traffic, that's the way to do things.